And the driving conditions are still dangerous out there, and they will be as long as the snow continues to come down. And for the latest on that situation, let's go to WXVT's meteorologist Steve Dreyer, who is reporting live tonight from the intersection of Highway 82 and Highway 1. Steve, what's going on? Kayla, I'm standing over here on the Highway 82 and Route 1 intersection. The snow continues to fall. It was like scenes like this that happened earlier today. Snow began falling earlier this afternoon, late this morning, and has quickly accumulated throughout the entire day. Two, three, or even four inches have fallen across the delta, and even traffic was at a standstill in some parts. People walked out, dushed off the snow from their cars in this chilly, cold, snowy weather, and the emergency and man management officials have a few words to say. Our job is going to be there. We're going to try to do what we can do. It makes the police department's job a lot easier because you have more accidents the more people they have on the street during this type of weather. So uh, so far so good. Accident calls are starting to roll in. Uh, a lot of people, a lot of people traveling, but uh, good good snow is not as hard to drive on as ice. But we still recommend people get uh, get home as soon as they can and, and stay there. The snow is accumulating on the roads pretty quick now, uh, and it's only going only going to go downhill from here. Roads will remain treacherous as temperatures stay below and drop below freezing tonight. Like Ray said earlier, we are in a hard freeze warning and travel is not recommended until sometime tomorrow as road crews will have a chance to get out and put sand and clear the roadways. So Caitlin and Earl, temperatures are below freezing, that the wind is picking up, snow is letting up. We did have some grapple earlier this evening as we were standing outside and the roads are looking pretty good getting pretty wet from all the travels overall not too bad reporting from greenville outside in this winter wonderland steve dreyer wxvt delta news well that's i'm glad he's there not me <laughs> well even though the snowy weather can